when we make essentially a cartoon of the past, when we make caricatures of our historical figures, and we make them into these kind of villainous cartoons, there's a big problem. I want to talk about what that problem is. And as an example of this phenomenon and of the problem itself, Let's talk about this situation with Laura Ingalls Wilder, uh, who, of course, was a famous author in the mid-19th century, early 20th century. She wrote the Little House on the Prairie books. But now the American Library Association is dropping her name from a prestigious children's award that, um, that they've been giving out for, I don't know, 50 or 60 years. They've had her name on it. And they're taking her name off. And there's this process now of kind of banishing her from from the, the children's literature space because of her culturally insensitive writings. So I want to read quickly a quote from Jim Neal, the uh, president of the American Library Association. He's explaining uh, this decision. He says, Wilder's books are a product of her life experiences and perspective as a settler in America's 1800s. Her works reflect dated cultural attitudes toward indigenous people and people of color, that contradict modern acceptance, celebration, and understanding of diverse communities. Well, geez, I mean, that's surprising, isn't it? That somebody who was writing in uh, 1905 would have a dated perspective on something. I mean, that's totally shocking, isn't it? 